Hello, Discovery Church family and friends. Today is day nine, Proverbs chapter nine. I hope you're doing well and staying safe uh, amidst all this uh, social distancing. Nonetheless, Proverbs nine for you today. Wisdom has built her house. She has hewn out its seven pillars. She has prepared her meat and fixed her and mixed her wine. She has also set her table. She has sent out her maids, and she calls from the highest point of the city. Let all who are simple come in here, she says to those who lack judgment. Come, eat my food and drink the wine I have mixed. Leave your simple ways, and you will live. Walk in the way of understanding. Whoever corrects a mocker invites insult. Whoever rebukes a wicked man incurs abuse. Do not rebuke a mocker, or he will hate you. Rebuke a wise man, and he will love you. Instruct a wise man, and he will be wiser still. Teach a righteous man, and he will add to his learning. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, and knowledge of the Holy One is understanding. For through me your days will be many, and years will be added to your life. If you are wise, your wisdom will reward you. If you are a mocker, you alone will suffer. The woman, folly, is loud. She is undisciplined and without knowledge. She sits at the door of her house on a seat at the highest point of the city, calling out to those who pass by who go straight on their way. Let all who are simple come in here, she says to those who lack judgment. Stolen water is sweet. Food eaten in secret is delicious. But little do they know that the dead are there that her guests are in the depths of the grave. Here Solomon contrasts two women, young women. One is a wise woman who builds a house, prepares a, a nice meal, and invites all to come to it and learn instruction, gain understanding, and so on. The other woman is portrayed as folly, and folly is undisciplined, lacks good judgment, serves stolen food and drink, and it, it's easy to really pick which way you should go by reading it this way, but in life we have great difficulty making wise choices. Here, wisdom leads to life, folly leads to death. So your wisdom nugget for today is choose wisely, choose wisdom, and live. See you tomorrow. God bless you.